guys, Laura here. I'm here today to do my October book haul. I got about six, seven books, so I'm going to show you them and tell you interesting stories that may have came up when I got them. The first book I got was my highly anticipated Blood of Olympus, which I went to his signing. He signed it for me. I got some really cool shirts as well, which was awesome. Um, but yeah, so this was a really, really good, I read it, I completed it, I will link my review below and my Goodreads and stuff, but yeah, very, very impressive. I also got, um, another new release is In the Afterlight by Alexandra Bracken, I'm in the middle of reading it, I also got her to sign this, again, really, really like it so far, I will do my full series review and my book review when I'm done, so keep a nose out for that. I also did an unexpected purchase from Book Outlet. I had to buy a children's mythology book from my educational theater class, and there was a few books that I just really, really wanted. Um, the first one was Sea of Shadows by Kelly Armstrong. This had a lot of buzz when it first came out, and it has to do with my favorite thing, twins. I'm sure you're shocked. Um, but I really wanted it, and when I saw it go on Book Outlet, I just could not resist. Um, I also bought The Monstromologist, which is by Rick Yancey. I have The Curse of the Windigo, which is the second one, which I got at my library book fair. So I figured why not get the first one. It was like $2. I could not help it. And I also got um, three books in a series. It is the Sherlock Holmes series, The Legend Begins by Andrew Lane. From what I gathered, this series is um, an approved story in the Sherlock Holmes universe. And it happens when Sherlock Holmes is 14 and a child. So I got Death Cloud, Black Ice, and Rebel Fire. And the series is called The Legend Begins. And this is the first teen series endorsed by the Arthur Conan Doyle estate. I've read a few books in the past like this, and they're really interesting. So um, I'm excited to see where this goes. I got all three books, so hopefully I'll be able to read this sometime soon. I also bought some ebooks this month, which I will attach pictures after I say this. I bought Spellcaster by Claudia Gray. I was going to buy it on Book Outlet, but I found it a daily deal from Kindle, so I got it for $1.99. And I also got The Girl of Fire and Thorns by Ray Carson. Again, I was going to buy it, but $1.99 my Kindle sounded like a really good deal. Here are the attached pictures. So those are the nine bucks I got this month. Um, I'll be honest, I'm probably going to be on a book buying slowdown until Christmas because I'm asking for a lot of books for Christmas. But I'm definitely going to buy myself The Spirit Glass Charade by Colleen Gleason so I can read it next month, as you'll see in my TBR video. But I hope you guys are having a good night. Bye, everyone.